<laughs> that's one place you can do today. Beautiful weather. There, there's other things you can do. And who does not love a rodeo? Later on today, you can check out a very special rodeo for kids in Cave Creek. With us now to tell us all about it is Dan Fowley. He is a rodeo announcer and is handling the duties at the Wayne Wilson Children's Charity Rodeo. Now, also with us this morning is rodeo bullfighter Lou Crow. Guys, tell us about this this charity you have going on. Today is the final day and it starts at 2 o'clock, right? 2 o'clock this afternoon, Ryan, and as Brittany was saying a little earlier in the weather, it'd be a good day to even hot mop a roof, but it's <laughs> a, it'd be a funner activity to come out and spend the afternoon with us for a good cause. Uh, the funds raised today yeah. via our campaign, Tough Enough to Wear Pink, those funds are today directed at the Phoenix Children's Hospital. So come out, be part of that. Um, Bring a canned food. We're having canned food drive. It'll get you parked for free. Uh, final performance of our PRCA rodeo is this afternoon, and it's been quite a shootout. There's talent with us from all over the Southwest. We have some Oklahoma and Nebraska Cowboys competing for the title as well. Right. These, these guys, they're going for big money here. This is PRCA, so this is this is top dollar. This is so. the road to the Super Bowl, and yeah. this is to rodeo what Major League Baseball is to uh, the Diamondbacks. Mm -hmm. um, this is a key piece of the puzzle for these rodeo athletes to win the money to become the top 15 which transitioned to our Super Bowl of the sport held in uh, December at the Thomas and Mack in Las Vegas, mm -hmm. the Wrangler National Finals. Also a key part of this rodeo is Luke here. Ex explain <laughs> what, what you do out there. Uh, my job as a bullfighter, I, I gotta keep the Cowboys safe. The, whether the guy makes a qualified ride and gets a score or whether he gets dusted and thrown off right there. Mm -hmm. It's my job to be a decoy, to come through and take that bull's attention off of the fallen cowboy onto me and get him out of there. People come out and watch. Are you the guy that's out there that's that's got the, the makeup on and such, or will people recognize you? No, I'll have the makeup on, I'll have the baggy pants and makeup on. I'm not the, not the funny guy, I'm there to, right. to save cowboys and uh, yeah. The, the guy that runs around by the chutes and yep, such. Yep, and distracts the bull and gets him away from the fallen cowboy, yeah. Now, Dan, the, the money here, this is the first time you've put this on, correct? This is our second annual. Second, okay. Yes, so last sir. year, how much money did you raise last year? Do you remember offhand? Uh, you know, I, I'm just a contract personnel in that I announced the rodeo, but it's my belief that they raised over $50,000. Over 50000 for the Phoenix Children's Hospital. I don't recall who our charity was last, last year, year, Ryan, but uh, this year crowds have already been bigger. Uh, the weather has been phenomenal, and the action's been great. And All right. Be One. part of it and help us uh, raise some money this afternoon. Absolutely. Gates open at noon. The rodeo begins at 2 o'clock. There's a carnival out there. The information is on the website or on the uh, full screen you see there and then on our website as well. Gentlemen, thank you for joining us this morning. Really appreciate thank it. You, thank you, Ryan. We really appreciate being here. Absolutely.